I am Chris Stonebreaker. This is The Court Report, and I'm joined here in the corporate office in Cameron Park, California, with Zach Pop. And hey, Zach, basketball season, league play is now here. Holiday tournaments have provided some of the best and biggest moments of the season. I tell you what, high school football was off the charts this year. Yeah. High school basketball following suit here in the early part of the season. And of course, for more on high school basketball, Let's bring in our national basketball editor, Jason Hickman, to talk about the Excellent 25 rankings. And this week, we saw nine new teams enter the Excellent 25. And one of the teams in the top 25 is one of the top teams in the country, of course, Cardinal Gibbons. And Jay, what do you have to say about Cardinal Gibby? Yeah, they kind of came out of nowhere. Got a big transfer in Pennsylvania transplant Maverick Rowan, who is committed to the Pittsburgh Panthers. Uh, back as a freshman now he's kind of back out on the market but he's really taken this program to a different level they played in three different tournament events over the holidays went 8-0 during that span and it, that included a big win over defending Florida State champ Sage Moss beat them by 20 at the Hot Rule Classic and that really propelled them onto the national stage Sage Mott went on to reach the semifinals of the prestigious beach ball classic in South Carolina. And Jay, I saw Oak Hill sitting pretty at number one. What's impressed you the most so far with Oak Hill so far in the early part of the season? Yeah, well, they've had the opportunity to kind of sit back and watch the last couple weeks. They haven't played uh, since December 20th when they won the Iolani Classic in Hawaii, but they deserve the break. They played a very difficult early schedule. They've faced four different teams that have uh, appeared in the rankings already and have run off 21 straight wins going into a big win uh, this weekend, which I'll tease for now. I know we're coming back to that later. And uh, talking about a team that's filled with a, a ton of diaper dandy, some of the best young players in all of high school basketball, led by Cody Riley, the sophomore sensation is Sierra Canyon. What do you have to say about them so far in the early part of the season? I know they've been in a couple of tough tourneys so far here in the season. Yeah, I went out on a, a little bit of a limb in the preseason ranking them number five. Uh, and remember, this is a team that starts four sophomores and a junior, and uh, they're going to be missing for the entire season the services of six foot eight sophomore Ira Lee, who some people think is a top 25 prospect. Uh, in America, he'll rejoin this team next year, but out with an injury this season. So what they've done, uh, nothing short of remarkable. Since they lost December uh, 19th at the City of Palms Classic, they've won nine games in a row, beat teams from seven different states, and last week, right on the heels of winning the Max Prep Holiday Classic, beat DeMatha and Corona Del Sol, who both came into those matchups undefeated. Man, it's just been crazy so far wow. this year. There's been so much movement in the Exit 25. We've seen teams come in and come out. I mean, it's just been a great start to the high school hoop season, baby. Oh, yeah. And with more big games up on the schedules for all of these teams with the MLK events coming in two weeks and as well as state playoffs yeah. and state championships, we know that there's going to be a lot more movement in those rankings.